Hi, everyone. Welcome. Thanks for joining us. My name is Robert. I'll be your co-host. Uh, we're here today for our latest presentation by our good friend, Edward. Um, Edward, I'll turn things over to you in just a minute. For those of you that are watching live on Zoom, Patty and I will be monitoring the chat and the Q&A. If you have any questions or comments for our host or the program in general, feel free to share those in the chat or in the Q&A. This program is being recorded for our YouTube channel, and we'll post the recording of that um, probably tomorrow. And with that, I will turn things over to Edward. Edward, it's all yours. Take it away. Thank you, Robert. Thank you, Patty. Good afternoon. My name is Ed Ingebretson. Thank you for joining uh, DC Culture and History this afternoon for the next hour. This afternoon's spoken word presentation speaks the names of persons killed by guns in the United States in public places since the killings at Columbine High School in 1999. In 2020, gun deaths reached their highest level in at least 40 years, with over 45,200 deaths that year alone. The number has since increased. Over 1 million Americans have been shot in the past decade. Gun violence rates are rising across the country. Nearly every American, those here present, those elsewhere, will know at least one victim of gun violence in their lifetime. Shown no respect in life for the next hour, we can at least honor these dead and acknowledge the atrocity of their dying in public in the United States, in places ordinarily considered safe. These lives cut short. April 20th, 1999, Columbine High School, Littleton, Colorado. These are the dead. Cassie Bernal, 17. Stephen Cronall, 14. Corey D. Puder, 17. Kelly Fleming, 16. Matthew Kector, 16. Daniel Mauser, 15. Daniel Rabo, 15. William Dave Saunders, 47. Rachel Scott, 17. Isaiah Scholes, 18. John Tomlin, 16. Lauren Townsend, 18. Kyle Velasquez, 16. May the memories be a blessing. March 21st, 2005, Red Lake High School on the Red Lake Indian Reservation, Minnesota. Derek Brun, 28. Dwayne Lewis, 15. Chase Lucier, 15. Daryl Lucier, 58. Neva Rogers, 62. Chanel Rosebear, 15. Michelle Sigana, 32. Therlene Stilday, 15. Alicia White, 15. May the memories be a blessing. October 2nd, 2006, at an Amish schoolhouse, Lancaster County, Pennsylvania. Naomi Ebersol, 7. Marion Stoltzus Fisher, 13. Lena Zook Miller, 7. Mary Liz Miller, eight. Anna Mae Stoltzus, 12.
well. May their memories be a blessing. April 16th, 2007, Virginia Tech, Blacksburg, Virginia. These are the dead. Rose Abdallah Almadeen, 20. Christopher James, 35. Brian Bloom, 25. Ryan Clark, 22. Austin Cloyd, 18. Jocelyn Couture Novak, 49. Daniel Perez Cueva, 21. Kevin Granada, 46. Matthew Jika Waltney, 24. Caitlin Hammerin, 19. Jeremy Herbstritt, 27. Rachel Elizabeth Howe, 18. Emily Hilscher, 19. Jarrett Lane, 22. Matthew J. Laporta, 20. Henry Lee, 20. Lee Labrescu, 76. G.V. Laganathan, 51. Patahi Lambanathan, 34. Lauren McCain, 20. Daniel O'Neill, 22. Juan Ramon Ortiz, 26. Minal Panchal, 26. Aaron Peterson, 18. Michael Pohl, 23. Julia Pride, 23. Mary Reed, 19. Reamer Samaha, 18. Walid Shalan, 32. Leslie Sherman, 20. Maxine Turner, 22. Nicole R. White, 20. May their memory be a blessing. December 5th, 2007. West Roads Mall, Omaha. Beverly Flynn, 47. Janet Jorgensen, 66. Gary Joy, 56. John McDonald, 65. Gary Sharp, 48. Angie Schuster, 36. Diane Trent, 53. Maggie Webb, 24. May their memory be a blessing. April 3rd, 2009, American Civic Association Immigration Services Center, Binghamton, New York. These are the dead. <clears throat> Barbini Ali, 26. Almir Alves, 43. Mark Henry Bernard, 44. Maria Sonia Bernard, 46. Ha Hyun, 54. Hong Ji Mu, 35. Jiang Ling, 22. Leila Cahill, 57. Roberta King, 72. Lan Ho, 39. Li Guo, 47. Dolores Yagal, 53. 
Maria Zabuno, 60. May their memory be a blessing. November 5th, 2009, Fort Hood, Texas. Michael Grant Cahill, 62. Roberto Eduardo Cuevo, 52. Justin Michael DeCraw, 32. John P. Gaffney, 56. Frederick Green, 29. Jason Dean Hunt, 22. Amy S. Kruger, 29. Aaron Thomas Minilka, 19. Michael S. Pearson, 22. Russell Seeger, 51. Francesca Velasquez, 21. Juanita L. Warman, 55. Kamsi Hyung, 23. May the memory be a blessing. January 8, 2011, in the parking lot of a grocery store near Tucson, Arizona. These are the dead. Christina Taylor Green, 9. Dorothy Morris, 76. John M. Rohr, 63. Phyllis Schneck, 79. Dorwan Standard, 76. Gabrielle Zimmerman, 30. May their memory be a blessing. On the 7th of February, 2012. <clears throat> Chardon High School in Chardon, Ohio. These are the dead. Demetrius Shulin, 16. Russell King, Jr., 17. Daniel Parmenter, 16. April 2nd, 2012, Oikos University in Oakland, California. Fearing Rinzing Biota, 38. Doris Chibuko, 40. Sonam Choyden, 33. Grace Yunia Kim, 23. Kathleen Ping, 24. Judith O. Seymour, 53. Lydia Sim, 21. May their memory be a blessing. July 30, 2021. 2012. Century Aurora 16 Movie Complex, Aurora, Colorado. Jonathan Blunk, 26. A.J. Boyk, 18. Jesse Childress, 29. Gordon W. Cowden, 51. Jessica Cowie, 24. John Thomas Larimer, 27. Matthew McQuinn, 27. Michaela Madick, 23. Veronica Moser Sullivan, 6. 
Alex Matthew Sullivan, 27. Alexander Tavis, 24. <clears throat> Rebecca Ann Wingo, 32. May their memories be a blessing. Fifth day of August, 2012, at the Sheep Temple, Wisconsin, in Oak Creek, Wisconsin. Satwan Singh Kalika, 65. Suveg Singh Katra, 84. Pamajit Kaur, 41. Prabhash Singh, 39. Ranjit Singh, 49. Sita Singh, 41. May their memory be a blessing. 14th of December, 2012. Sandy Hook Elementary School, Newton, Connecticut. These are the dead. Charlotte Bacon, six. Daniel Barden, seven. Rachel Diavino, 29. Olivia Engel, six. Josephine Gay, seven. Dylan Hockley, six. Dawn Hoshfung, 47. Madeline Sue, six. Catherine V. Hubbard, six. Chase Kowalski, seven. Jesse Lewis, six. Anna Marquise Green, six. James Matoli, six. Grace McDonald, seven. Anna Marie Murphy, 52. Emily Parker, six. Jack Pinto, Six. Norm Posner, six. Carolyn Pavidi, six. Jessica Rakos, six. Abel Richmond, six. Lauren Rousseau, thirty. Mary Sherlock, fifty-eight. Victoria Soto, 27. Benjamin Wheeler, 6. Allison N. Wyatt, 6. May the memory of these lives be a blessing. September 16th, 2013, at the Washington, D.C. Navy Yard. Michael Arnold, 59. Martin Bodrig, 54. Arthur Daniels, 51. Sylvia Fraser, 53. Kathy Gard, 62. John Roger Johnson, 73. Mary Frances Knight, 51. Frances Kohler, 51. Vishnu Bashandra Pandit, 61. Kenneth Bernard Proctor, 46. Gerald Reed, 58. Richard Ridgell, 52. May the memory of this dead be a blessing. June 17th, 2015, 
at Emmanuel African Methodist Episcopal Church, Charleston, South Carolina. These are the dead. Sharonda Coleman Singleton, 45. DePayne V. Middleton Doctor, 49. Cynthia Graham Hurd, 54. Susie Jackson, 87. Ethel Lee Lance, 70. Clementa C. Pickney, 41. Twanza Sanders, 26. Daniel Simmons, 74. Myra Thompson, 59. May the memory of these lives be a blessing. July 16th, 2015, at an Armed Services Recruiting Center in the Navy Reserve Center, Chattanooga, Tennessee. These are the dead. Carson A. Holmquist, 25. Randall Smith, 26. Thomas J. Sullivan, 40. Squire K. Skip Wells, 21. David A. Wyatt, 35. May the memory of these lives be a blessing. October 1, 2015, at a community college in Roseburg, Oregon, these are the dead. Lucero Alcaraz, 19. Trevin Taylor Onsbach, 20. Rebecca Ann Carnes, 18. Quinn Glenn Cooper, 18. Kim Saltmar Dietz, 59. Lucas Ivel, 18. Jason Dale Johnson, 33. Lawrence Levine, 67. Serena Dawn Moore, 44. May the memories of these lives be a blessing. November 27th, 2015, at a planned parenthood clinic in Colorado Springs. Jennifer Markovsky, 36. Carrie M. Stewart, 29. Garrett Swayze, 44. Sarah Swayze, 45. May the memory of these lives be a blessing. December 2nd, 2015, at an office park in San Bernardino, California. Robert Adams, 40. Isaac Amanios, 60. Bennett Bethaldahl, 46. Harry Bauman, 46. Sierra Claiborne, 27. Juan Espinoza, 50. Aurora Godoy, 26. Shannon Johnson, 45. Larry Daniel Kaufman, 42. Damian Means, 58. Tin Nguyen, 31. 
Nicholas Thalassinos, 52. Yvette Velasco, 27. Michael Raymond Wetzel, 37. May the memory of these lives be a blessing. June 12, 2016, Pulse Nightclub at Orlando, Florida. These are the dead. Stanley Alvaro III, 23. Amanda L. Alvier, 25. Oscar A. Aracena Montero, 26. Adolfo Ayaya, 33. Antonio Devon Brown, 29. Daryl Roman Burke II, 29. Angel Candelario Padra, 28. Juan Chavez Martinez, 25. Luis Daniel Pondo, 39. Corey James Conley, 21. Devon Ogin Crosby, 25. Dianca Deirdre Droyton, 32. Simone Andrian Carrillo Fernandez, 31. Leroy Valentin Fernandez, 25. Mercedes Marisol Flores, 26. Peter Ami Gonzalez Cruz, 22. Juan Ramon Guerrero, 22. Paul Terrell Henry, 41. Frank Hernandez, 27. Miguel Angel Honorato, 30. Javier Jorge Reyes, 40. Jason Benjamin Josephat, 19. Eddie Jamaldre Justice, 30. Anthony Luis Loriano Bisla, 25. Christopher Andrew Leonin, 32. Alejandro Barrios, 21. Brenda Marquez, 42, 49. Gilberto R. Silva Menendez, 25. Kimberly Jean Morris, 37. Akira Monet Murray, 18. Luis Omar Ocasio Capo, 20. Geraldo A. Ortiz Jimenez, 25. Eric Ivan Ortiz Rivera, 36. Joe Rayon Panagwe, 32. Jean Carlos Mendez Perez, 35. Enrique O. Rios, 25. Juan Carlos Nieves Rodriguez, 27. Javier Emanuel Serrano Rosado, 35. Christopher Joseph San Feliz, 24. Romero Rodriguez Sullivan, 24. Edward Sotomayor, Jr. 34. Shane Evanson Thomason, 33. Martin Benitez Torres, 33. 
Jonathan Kumue Vega, 24. Juan Pablo Rivera Vasquez, 37. Luis Sergio Vilma, 22. Frankie Jimmy De Jesus Velasquez, 50. Daniel Wilson Leon, 37. Gerald Arthur Wright, 31. Marie Luis, 49. Terry Andres, 42. Michelle Ame, 57. Olga Walterain, 13. May the memory of these many dead be blessings. October 1st, 2017 on the Las Vegas Strip. These are the dead. Hannah Alvarez, 34. Heather Alvarado, 35. Dorene Anderson, 49. Carrie Barnett, 34. Jack Beaton, 54. Stephen Berger, 44. Candace Bowers, 40. Denise Burditus, 50. Sandy Casey, 35. Andre Castilla, 28. Denise Cohen, 58. Austin Davies, 29. Thomas Day, Jr., 54. Cristiana Duarte, 22. Stacy Rodriguez, Icabar, 50. Brian Frazier, 39. Carrie Galvin, 31. Dana Gardner, 52. Angela Gomez, 20. Charleston Hartfield, 34. Christopher Hazencombe, 44. Jennifer Topaz, 42. Teresa Nicole Kinora, 38. Jessica Klimchuk, 34. Carly Krebon, 33. Rhonda LaRoque, 42. Victor Link, 55. Jordan Mockledoon, 23. Kelsey Brian Menos, 28. Kala Marie Medig, 28. Sonny Melton, 29. Patricia Mestas, 67. Austin Myers, 24. Adrian Murphit, 35. Rachel Parker, 33. Jennifer Parks, 36. Carolyn Parsons, 31. Lisa Patter, 21. Quentin Robbins, 20. Cameron Robinson, 28. Rocio Guillen Rocha, 40. Tara Rowe, 34. Lisa Romero Muniz, 48. Christopher Ruboyle, 28. Brett Schwanbeck, 61. Ailey Schweitzer, 20. Laura Schiff, 50. Eric Silva, 
point to one. Susan Smith, 53. Brennan Stewart, 30. Derek Taylor, 56. Nasa Tonks, 46. Michelle Vaux, 32. Kurt Von Tillow, 55. Bill Wolf Jr., 42. May the memory of these many dead be a blessing. On the fifth day of November, 2017, at the First Baptist Church in Sutherland Springs, Texas, these are the dead. Keith Allen Braden, 62. Robert Michael Corrigan, 21. Shawnee Louise Corrigan, 51. Emily Garcia, 7. Emily Rose Hill, 11. Gregory Lynn Hill, 13. Megan Gale Hill, 9. Crystal Marie Holcomb, 36. John Bryan Holcomb, 60. Carla Plain Holcomb, 58. Mark Daniel Holcomb, 36. Noah Holcomb, 13. Dennis Neal Johnson, 77. Sarah Johns Johnson, 68. Haley Kruger, 16. Robert Scott Marshall, 56. Karen Sue Marshall, 56. Tara E. McNulty, 33. Annabelle Brene Pomeroy, 13. Ricardo Cordona Rodriguez, 64. Teresa Rodriguez, 66. Brooke Brian Ward, 5. Joanne Looking Bill Ward, 30. Peggy Lynn Warden, 56. Lula Wasinski White, 71. May the memory of these dead be honored. February 14th, 2018, Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School in Parkland, Florida. These are the dead. Alyssa Aldahab, 14. Scott Biagle, 35. Martin Duque, 14. Nicholas Dorrett, 17. Aaron Feist, 37. Jamie Gutenberg, 14. Chris Hickson, 49. Luke Hoyer, 15. Carol Lothram, 14. Gina Montolo, 14. Joaquin Oliver, 17. Elena Petty, 14. Madison Pollock, 18. Elena Ramsey, 17. Alex Schachter, 14. Carmen Shentrup, 16. Peter Wang, 16. May the memory of these dead be a blessing. At Santa Fe High School in Santa Fe, Texas on May 18th, 2018, these are the dead. Jared Black, 17. Shanna Fisher, 16. Christian Riley Garcia, 15. Aaron 
Kyle McLeod, 15. Glenda Ann Perkins, 64. Angelique Ramirez, 15. Sabika Sheik, 17. Christopher Stone, 17. Cynthia Tisdale, 63. Kimberly Vaughn, 14. May the memory of these dead be a blessing. October 27th, 2018 at the Tree of Life Synagogue in Pittsburgh. These are the dead. Joyce Feinberg, 75. Richard Gottfried, 65. Rose Malinger, 97. Jerry Rabinowitz, 66. Cecil Rosenthal, 59. David Rosenthal, 54. Bernice Simon, 84. Sylvan Simon, 86. Daniel Stein, 71. Melvin Wax, 87. Irving Younger, 69. May the memory of these dead be honored. November 7th, 2018, Thousand Oaks, California. These are the dead. Sean Adler, 48. Cody Kaufman, 22. Blake Dingman, 21. Jake Dunham, 21. Ron Hellis, 54. Elena Hoosley, 18. Dan Monique Rake, 33. Justin Meek, 33. Mark Metzer, Jr., 20. Christina Morissette, 20. Telemachus Orphanus, 27. Noel Sparks, 21. May the memory of these honored dead be blessed. May 31st, 2019. Virginia Beach Municipal Center in Virginia Beach. These are the dead. Lakita C. Brown, 39. Ryan Keith Cox, 50. Tara Welch Gallagher, 39. Mary Louise Gale, 65. Alexander Michel Rousseff, 35. Joshua O. Hardy, 52. Michelle Missy Longer, 60. Richard A. Nettleton, 65. Catherine A. Nixon, 42. Christopher Kelly Rapp, 54. Herbert Burt Snelling, 57. Robert Bobby Williams, 72. May the memory of these honored dead be blessing. On the 3rd of August in 2019 at a Walmart Supercenter in El Paso. These are the dead. Andre Anchando, 24. Jordan Anchando, 25. Arturo Benavides, 60. Leo Campos, 41. Angelina Inglesby, 86. Maria Flores, 77. Raul Flores, 83. 
Jorge Calvillo Garcia, 61. Adolfo Cerros Hernandez, 68. Maribel Hernandez, 56. Alexander Gerhard Hoffman, 66. David Johnson, 63. Luis Juarez, 90. Maria Eugenia Liguata, 58. Ivana Filberto Manzano, 45. Gloria Irma Marques, 61. Elsa Mendoza, 57. Margie Record, 63. Sarah Esther Rivaldo, 66. Javier Amir Rodriguez, 15. Teresa Sanchez, 82. Juan de Dios Velasquez, 77. May the memory of these dead be a blessing. On the 16th of March in 2021 at spas in the Atlantic area, these are the dead. Dao Yu Feng, 44. Huen Hyung Grant, 51. Sun Cha Kim, 69. Paul Andre Michels, 54. Soon Shun Park, 74. Bishole Tan, 49. Dilana Ashley Yan, 33. Young Ai Hui, 63. May the memory of these honored dead be a blessing. Twenty second day of March in twenty twenty one at King Super Supermarket in Boulder, Colorado. These are the dead. Toyona Botoski, forty nine. Suzanne Fountain, fifty nine. Terry Leaker, fifty one. Kevin Mahoney, sixty one. Lynn Murray, sixty two. Ricky Oles, 25. Levin Stanzik, 23. Danny Stone, 20. Eric Tolley, 51. Jody Waters, 65. May the memory of these honored dead be blessings. Fifteenth of April, twenty twenty one, at a FedEx facility in Indianapolis. These are the dead. Matthew Ross Alexander, thirty two. Samaria Blockwell, nineteen. Amaji Jual, sixty six. Jaswinder Kuwar, fifty. Jaswinder Singh, sixty eight. Amrit Sikon, 48. Carly Smith, 19. John Weissert, 174. May the memory of these dead be honored. April 3, 2022, in downtown Sacramento, John Tyler Alexander, 21. Melinda Davis, 57. Sergio Harris, 38. Joshua Hoy Lucisi, 32. Yamale Martinez Andrade, 21. Venezia Turner, 21. May the memory of this honored dead be a blessing. On the 14th of May, 2022, at a Tops Friendly Market in Buffalo. 
These are the dead. Celestine Cheney, 65. Roberta Drury, 32. Andre McNeil, 53. Catherine Kai Massey, 72. Okay, Stu Morrison, 52. Hayward Patterson, 67. Aaron Salter Jr., 55. Geraldine Talley, 62. Ruth Whitfield, 86. Pearl Young, 77. May the memory of these honored dead be blessings. On the 24th of May, 2022, at Duvalde, Texas, Robb Elementary, the 21 persons massacred at the Uvalde school shooting. McKenna Lee Elrod, 10. Layla Salazar, 11. Miranda Mathis, 11. Nevea Bravo, 10. Jose Manuel Flores Jr., 10. Javier Lopez, 10. Tess Marie Mata, 10. Rogelio Torres, 10. Eleja Eleli Ama Garcia, 9. Paulina A. Torres, 10. Annabelle Guadalupe Rodriguez, 10. Jackie Cesares, 9. Josea Garcia, 7. Jace Carmelo Rabunas, 10. Maita Juliana Rodriguez, 10. Haila Nicole Severo, 10. Irma Garcia, 48. Eva Morales, 44. Armorejo Garza, 10. Alitha Ramirez, 10. Alexandria Lexi Anya Rubio 10. May the memory of these honored dead and all honored dead mentioned this afternoon and those whom I have missed or have gone not been amiss may be honored and may they be blessing. During the last 72 hours since Friday, there have been 100 gun deaths in the United States. There have been 265 injuries. May all of these persons be remembered. And let's pause for a moment of silence. And then, Robert, uh, it's back to you. Thank you for being part of us this afternoon. Okay, Edward, thank you for your time going through and listening to the names. I was really, I already knew this, but I, it was a reaffirmation. I was really struck just by how many um, religious institutions were the site of these events. Normally we think of those places as being uh, safe havens and then also of course schools. Um, just, I think people already know that, but just kind of a reaffirmation that so many of these events unfortunately take place at those two types of institutions. and. When we're out in public, we're just going to have to keep our guard up as much as possible, unfortunately. I'm not sure if anyone else has any questions or comments for our host, Edward. If you do, feel free to type those in the chat or in the Q&A. As a reminder, this program is being recorded. We'll post it on our YouTube page. Uh, Edward, appreciate you going through. I accidentally clicked on a button and paused the recording for a few seconds, but it picked it back up. Um, so we should be in good shape there. Um, sorry, I hope I didn't interrupt you too much. Um, but again, thank you so much for your time. Any closing uh, I, thoughts I before say, we I say to you and to Patty, uh, we thank you for your time and for making a platform where people can um, 
can do something, which is starting with education. Uh, and if saying the names is important, attending to these and passing on the information in the various ways that each one of us, small and large, can do that. Uh, whatever small work we do is important that we do it. Mm -hmm. So we got a question came up from Melissa. What are we going to do about all this? I guess, um, you know, there's so many, uh, there's so much talk about politics and I don't want to get into a political discussion um, because that's very divisive. But what else do you recommend people doing other than um, non-political, when I say non-political, I mean like non-voting stuff. What, what do you recommend people do for this um, type of situation? Well, I, I will say back to the politics here, two of the slides say contact your representatives and all you have to do is Google contact your representatives. Um, all of the senators who voted no on the gun bill received money from the NRA. Just saying. Hmm. That's a fact. You can find that in the thing. Um, it does not hurt to start with the political. Uh, to say that we can't do anything politically is, is basically to give this give this um, give this to, to our children. Oh no, I didn't mean it in that way. What I meant was I think people are kind of already aware of what side of the issue they're on or what other people are on. I didn't know if there was any other things beyond that. The US I, I guess what I consider, I consider like the political thing to be kind of um, self-explanatory, like people know what they need to do if they're going to work on this. But is there other things that people could do beyond elections? You know, what are the people do the other um, 300 and some days a year when there aren't elections taking place that they can do? You know, honestly, Robert, uh, simply scan through, put in a, a good gun use in the United States in the last 20 years, uh, and you, you come up with graphs and charts, and you, you look at, for example, at, at shootings in schools. Now, many of the um, tragedies this afternoon were school-related, not all of them, but when you pull up specifically schools, my point earlier about sacred and safe spaces, there is not a, a safe space. Um, I will tell you that, uh, I have a more politicized version of this particular uh, presentation, which shows how different um, jurisdictions are taking care of in their schools. You know what they're doing? They're giving teachers bats and they're putting buckets of rocks in the classroom. I kid you not. You can Google this yourself. You can see pictures of the rocks. You can see pictures of the school superintendent giving small bats to the, to the faculty. Uh, and you have the Evaldi situation. I, I, no, I have no comment on this. Uh, the, then you look at a place like DC, for example, where 5% of the schools have had violence in them. One does not hear this, for example, and I live in DC. Many of us listening may. Um, so I think the work that we can do is do what we can to educate ourselves and not to be polite about it in the sense of um, to talk about it. Have an opinion. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Sorry. Yeah, I actually um, a couple of years ago participated in active shooter training, which was um, boy, it's unfortunate that that type of thing is even necessary, but it was really enlightening and just to go through that and um, tactics and techniques and strategies to stay safe during a um, active shooting situation. It, re it really stuck with me more, more than more than the usual corporate training that you have to sit through um, during your career. But what about your perspective? Like you're an educator, um, or have you seen this type of training in schools? That I would say, for example, use the word. These aren't shooters. This is murder. This mm -hmm. is I mean, I, I don't avoid that kind of language, uh, and I would, and I say that in a variety of different situations too, that we use the language that says something, this is not an active shooter, this is, what do you call it, it's a massacre or whatever, whatever word you want to use, but be more attention to that, more attentive to that. Um, I will say there are certain schools in certain states where I teach where I will not, well, I will not take classes because they have open carry and students on campus have guns. Mm -hmm. It's not, it's, I'm, I'm, so, I'm, I'm sorry about that, but um, until, until that changes. But, and I don't know if there's any data around this, but it seems like recently just so many of these um, shooters slash murderers have been so young, it's really um, very disturbing. Um, 
Right. I have no. I mean, that's one of the reasons I'm doing this this afternoon. Each one of us has a has a skill that we can do, Robert, and um, and not everyone has access to the to the wealth of possibilities that you you give. But whether we have a forum like this, whether we're in a classroom, whether where we work, keeping ourselves safe, it's not much more complicated than the mask or, or the different ways in which we we keep a safe personal space and simply being alert to what's what's happening around us. Okay, excellent. Well, in August, Edward is hosting two in-person walking tours in Washington, D.C., one on the National Mall, one in Georgetown, talking about slavery and emancipation in Washington, D.C. Um, I'll send out the email information for that to everyone who signed up for today's program in case you want to join uh, Edward in person and learn some more of the things that he's um, has available for us. So Edward, thank you so much for your time. Greatly appreciate once again. Um, we recording this program. It'll be on our YouTube page. You probably won't be able to load it up until tomorrow though. Um, and I'll send out the link for that in case you joined us late or if you want to listen to it again um, or if you know anyone else that might be interested. So with that, uh, Edward, any final thoughts before we part? Assalamu alaikum. Peace to everyone here and to yours. Be safe. Excellent. Okay. Thank you, Edward. Greatly appreciate your time. Thanks everyone. Stay safe out there. We'll see you next time.